Alex, as the live television director, you're basically the king of logistics. If, if the big challenge on Hairspray was making sure your cameras were all in the right places and moving all around from primary set to secondary set to tertiary set, what's the biggest challenge in this, given that it is a little bit of a different format? I think each one of these live events has have uh, different ideals to stand up to. I think with, with this format, the two greatest things that we're going to lean into in terms of the visual performance are the band being front and center of the performance space. And so being able to stage narrative directly in front of those musicians and making them feel like the, the beating heart of the show, which they are, um, in, in primary background shots, I think that's really exciting for us. Um, and also using an audience of approximately 1,500 people in the venue um, allowing them to be a very visceral part of the, the staging of the event. That's something that David and me are thrilled to do. And so we're trying to break down the boundaries between a very delineated audience. Um, on previous, uh, uh, previous live event shows that we've done, the audience has been a much smaller entity and generally been a side theme to the event. With this show, what we're allowed to do is put the audience as a wraparound two entire sides of the set kind of having a mosh audience of, of, of hundreds of people directly adjacent to the performance space. And then in certain scenes, we're going to blend that uh, audience and primary performance area so that the demarcation is slightly blurred so that we can, as a viewer at home, you can start to use that audience kind of like a crowd scene where they are interacting with primary characters. And I think that's exciting. You know, we, we very clearly from the get-go on this project, we wanted to lean into the energy of all those people in the house. We want it to be a rock concert. We want it to be this rock opera that had this visceralness to it. So for me, as the live television director, I'm trying to design coverage um, that not only plays best to the performances of our lead characters and tells the story, but also tells for the viewers at home, tells it from the perspective a little bit of that audience and really gets into some of the energy of what it feels like to be in that house and see that presentation. 